you sure you know where you're going? Cotter? Let's see that map again. So you're asking now, are you? Surprised you haven't taken it from my pocket already. How much food we got left? Here we are. Carried. How's the food? That we should keep moving. Better if we're moving in the right direction, though. Doesn't matter if we all starve before we even get there. We're on the right track. This way. The free folk. Oh, this. Oh, this complicates things. You stay here. I'll try and talk to her. I'm one of them. Wait, what? He's a fucking wildling, Otter! They might kick me around a little, but whatever you do, don't come out, all right? She has to think I'm alone. If she sees you, you'll only make things worse. Good on, Ting. No, I'm... Uh... I'm a friend. I grew up near Ardholm. You know it? I won't hurt you. All right. You won't. I'm one of you. I'm... Oh! oh. You sure look like a crow oh, to I'm me. Not. You're dressed like one. You out here all alone, little pup. Come out or I'll kill your friend! Or I'll make him scream first. Listen, I don't want to fight. Then you shouldn't have come here. He's not alone. I knew a little crow wouldn't wander off by himself. Leave them be, all right? Just... just take me. Let him go. That we're just passing through. We didn't mean any harm. Right. You and your fuckless men just want to kill us all and take our land. But you didn't mean any harm. Carrot. <whistles> kill them! Yeah, it's over. Just don't do it. Garrett, let her go. Are those the last of our supplies. Can't stay here. You're hurt. Come on. We can rest up ahead.
thought I'd feel better, seeing Griff dragged out of the Great Hall like that. You wanted to kill him, didn't you? How did you know when to stop? I don't think I could have. I suppose that's why you're the Lord. I just knew it wasn't right. It wasn't the Lord I wanted to be. What do you think Lord Whitehill will do when he hears? If he truly has a spy... He won't know of this. Not until we want him to. The gates are barred and every raven in the rookery is dead. My lord, there's been a message from High Point. Lord Whitehill invites you to discuss a truce. He wants to make peace. As if we're that naive. Maybe this is an opportunity. A way to get behind their walls. And do what? You'd be putting yourself in danger, Roderick. She's right. What do you hope to accomplish? We could get Ryan back. This could be our chance. You're right. Now that we have Griff, we can propose a trade. A trade? Uh, his son for my brother. Then we have a plan. We'll leave first thing tomorrow morning. If you're going ahead with this, at least bring the Glenmore soldiers. We obviously need them here. You can't mean for Roderick to travel unprotected. What if the White Hills attack Ironrath while he's gone? My lord, you cannot go into an enemy stronghold unprotected. Nor can you leave Ironrath vulnerable. We have small folk soldiers. They're... Ironrath is ours again. The Glenmores will ensure it stays that way. Let Arthur know at once. Yes, my lord. I'll start making the preparations. To think that one of them might be spying for the White Hills. Duncan wanted you to travel to High Point without any protection. Yet Royland would leave Ironrath defenseless. Well, I'll need an advisor with me at High Point. By rights, it should be your sentinel. But if we're going to an enemy stronghold, maybe you'd best take Sir Royland. It's meant to be a negotiation, not a battle. How could any of them betray us? I've known these people my whole life. I wish I knew. Still, we can bring only one. Sir Royland comes with us. Duncan can stay here and defend Ironrath. Very well. Roderick, I know I can't come to High Point. But I can't just sit around and do nothing. I want to help. Please. I'll do anything you ask of me. Even something dangerous. Talia, I may be leaving you here with a traitor. Find out who it is. Find proof if you can. I'll... I'll do my best. I have faith in you, Talia. I've known Lud Whitehill a long time. He's selfish, greedy, and arrogant. But he'd never kill a guest in his own home. At least, I don't think he would. I hope you're right, Mother. Don't worry about me. Focus on the mission. Your family needs you. That's what matters right now. <laughs> You're my family too, Malcolm. And I couldn't be prouder of you. Good luck, my boy. Shall we begin? Listen up! There are four of these guard posts throughout the city. They'll use them to warn the masters in case the slaves decide they're tired of wearing chains. 
We're here to make sure they don't see it coming. Serend, you take the north. Penn, the south. Asher, we'll take the east. And Kirin will cover the west. Make the enemy blind. Give the Unsullied a chance to get in and arm the slaves. The rest is up to them. Don't get cocky out there. One mistake, and the man oh, you your remember side when we stole that you giant warhammer? Get in, do what From you have woman to do, in and get your people Didn't out she hit you in the face with it? That's all you I need never to thought my head could feel any worse. You got that. Tonight, any man who wishes to be free may take that freedom from the grip of his master. You will clear a path for them, but they must walk it alone. Justice belongs to the people of Marine. Do not make them wait any longer. What does she know of justice? Is there a problem? If you can't do this, tell me now. The Masters will be judged by the people of Marine, not by you. You don't have to worry about us. Just point us at the people you want dead, we'll take it from there. You enjoy this far more than you should. Kill only those you must. You will both do as Croft commands. Follow his orders exactly, or you will get nothing. Now go. Show them the hell they have made here. I hoped I'd never see this place again. Tried to run once. Didn't make it very far. Which way? There's a path around there. Voids the main street. Let's just get this over with. What's the matter, Croft? You see how many guards are out there? How were you expecting to get past them? We'll be caught. You asked me which way. This is it. Then we'll stay out of sight. Follow me. Can you see anyone? Cover me. Oh. Been used recently. There's our target. We should hurry. Shall she? 
We have to go. There's something I have to do. Vesca, what are you doing? Do you trust me, Asher? We don't have time for this. Just tell me. Do you trust me? Of course I trust you. Good. This won't take long. Vesca! Where are you going? Follow her! Why are you doing this? Ten years ago. Veska! No! I should have killed you. Veska! I should have fucking killed you! Veska! He was my master. Dezozoraza. The man who forced me to... Don't do this, Veska. You don't have to kill him. I can't let him live. You of all people should know that. Have you lost your mind? I'm ordering you to back away. <sighs> my... my Veska. I am not. Let no, him go. What are you doing? I shoot. You will do as I say. Both of you, take her weapon. I need to do this, Asher. After everything he's done. And he'll pay for it. Once the city is free, he will be punished. Punished by a queen who has no right to. His life means nothing to her. She does not speak for the children who died in those pits. Asher, stop her! I will get their justice. I won't let you ruin this for me. You heard what Daenerys said. You're... Let go of me. <coughs> I'm doing this, Asher. Take your hand off me. You may think you want this, but vengeance isn't the answer. You won't feel any better in the end. Damn you, Asher. Wait! <sighs> we might just make it out of this alive yet. She's just getting started. Gonna tell me he's a fucking wildly. Not now, Finn. Come on. What the hell is this place? An old haunting camp. We can rest here. Until your friends attack us again. I know the signs, all right? It's abandoned. Ah. I'm gonna go make sure nobody's lurking around out here. Don't trust this fucking place. Fine. Here. Let me take a look at it. Ha! Huh. 
How bad is it? Uh, I don't have anything to clean it with. Oh, great. Of course, I die by bloody infection. Don't say that. Oh. Oh, you got anything to drink? This far north and I still have to fetch the fucking wine. Some water or something, please. I'll see what I can find. Whoever was living here must have left. Too bad they didn't leave anything behind. Seems like a warning to me. Still don't trust him, you know. I know. He nearly got us all killed. Fuck, maybe that's what he wanted to happen. Why else would he bring us here? Finn, you're imagining things. Do you really think Cotter tried to get us killed? I just have a bad feeling about him, all right? I've had enough people screw me over. Oh, I've seen this before. Don't move. I'm warning you. Oh, I'll... I'll gut you like a fucking fish. <laughs> you do look like a sad little fish, don't you? That happened a lot. I can fix it for you. But my friend is hurt. We're just looking for a place to rest. There are others with you. Step back! <laughs> Wanna kill her yourself or should I do it? Garrett! Drop your weapon! Is that? Just let us go. We'll leave. That's what you want, isn't it? Cotter! Oh, Sylvie. You're alive! Who's this fucking snowball? I told you I'd come back. Who are these people? They're friends. Right. You're planning on introducing us, Cotter? Right. Uh... Huh. This... is my sister, Sylvie. She's the reason I brought you here. She can take us to the North Grove. Lord Roderick. Lady Alyssa. Gwyn? Roderick, may I have a word? Thank you for accepting my father's invitation. I wasn't certain you'd come, but it's a good thing you did. Be honest with me. Am I in danger here? My father honors guest right, just as you do. And I'm supposed to trust my life to that. I heard what happened with Griff. You did? How you refused to submit to him. You're too strong-headed, Roderick. My father's convinced you mean to rebel. So if you value your life and your family, you'll listen to what he has to say. You need to take him seriously today, which means keeping a level head. I'm here in good faith, aren't I? Yes, I suppose you are. 
There are lords who wield power, and lords who like to make a show of it. These walls hold a thousand years of White Hill history. A thousand years of bloodshed. But our houses were close once, and could be again. So much of our history has been lost. Shall we get on with it? The Great Hall is this way. Your soldiers seem on edge. Well, what do you expect? The way they see it, the enemy is within their walls. What's this? My lady? Give us a moment. Is this your family? Shortly before Griff was born. Is that your mother? Yes. Though I hardly remember her. She died not long after this was made. That must be you. A <laughs> much younger me. Yes. You look a bit like your mother now. Your father doesn't smile much, does he? He used to, when my mother was still alive. Are these your brothers? The eldest three, yes. Carl died of grayscale a few years ago. Ebbets at the Citadel. Torin serves Roose Bolton. And Griff, of course, wasn't born yet. My brothers were never kind to Griff. He was boastful, gullible, and quick to anger. But my father always defended him. A white hill is a white hill, he'd say. Come on, we mustn't keep my father waiting. Where's your father? Strange. I'll go find him. I don't like this. Don't show fear. That's what he wants. Ryan for Griff. That's still our plan. I'll follow your lead, my lord. Let's have a look around, see what we find. Mother, look at this. This ironwood's cracked. I'm not surprised. The White Hills were never any good at the craft. Oi! Step away from that! to betray us. Bread and salt would mean we're protected by guest right. He's testing us, seeing what we're made of. Roderick! Welcome to High Point. Lord, my men say you've been acting a bit Tense. You're not nervous, are you? You kept us waiting, Lord. What can I say? I lost track of time. Can we just get on with this?
You know, your father once called High Point a keep for the gods. What stonework, he said. What craftsmanship. He wouldn't stop talking about it. If you ask me, I'd say he was envious. High Point is very impressive. It is, compared to your pile of timber. Lord, where's Ryan? Always worried about your family, aren't you? Let's toast to family! Won't you toast with me, Roderick? To family. <laughs> to family. To family. Now, I want to see Ryan. And I want something too. The ironwood business is thriving, Roderick. In fact, the Boltons want weapons faster than we can make them. And when Roose Bolton wants something, I like to give it to him. You brought me here to discuss Ironwood. I brought you here to discuss your family's future. You foresters are headed for destruction. Yet, you know more about Ironwood than any house in the realm. Would be a shame for all that knowledge to be lost. Help me craft ironwood for the Boltons, and I'll make sure you foresters survive. As if he'd protect us. <laughs> if you think you can threaten I'm us. I'm not threatening. So you're proposing an alliance? An alliance? I said nothing of the sort. He'd make us his slaves. Roderick, this could save your house. I'd consider an alliance. You see what I have to put up with? Just give him time. I told you... I offer you peace. And you spit at it. I offer opportunity. And you demand more. Need I remind you? You kiss my ring. Here's how it's gonna go, Roderick. Either you agree to my terms, or I'll have Griff tear Iron Wrath to the ground. You put it to the torch! This isn't the way to Let get what get you want! Let me get slaughtering your small folk! Griff's no longer in charge of Iron Man. What are you talking about? He's locked in our darkest cellar along with your entire fucking garrison. You didn't. You've imprisoned my son. He was there by order of the Warden of the North! Roderick, how could you? Now it's my turn to propose a deal. Your son, Griff, for my brother, Ryan. We want Ryan back, and we want him today. Bring the boy! Ryan! Mother! Roderick! You came, just like you said you would! <laughs> No! Father, no! What are you doing? You imprisoned my flesh and blood. Mine! Let him go! He's not going anywhere! Listen to her! Don't I do swear this. by the gods if you He's a child! Uh, a son for a son! This is not what we are doing! I'm doing. him! Not me! If you want to see Griff alive again. You think I give two shits about Griff? <laughs> about my fucking fourthborn? Power! <laughs> I ought to kill you right now! Because you foresters will never I'm learn. I'm not afraid of you! Can I fucking murder him yet? Try it! Why are you so Let him go! Now. Go on then! Do it! What? You think I won't? I know you won't. Don't test him, Roderick! Just for all your bluster, all your posturing, you care about your son. Whitey is still a white. You know what, Roderick? You're right. Uh, <clears throat> Ryan, come here. No. We'll make the trade on neutral soil. Griff for Ryan. A son for a son. Fine. Now, get the fuck out of my hall. And the gods have mercy on us both. When the Boltons come for their ironwood. 
Now go. It's been a pleasure, Lord. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Roderick. There it is. The East Watcher. 